Well, hello there, Swashbucklers. Retro Rob here, and welcome to Indie Adventures, where we search far and wide for games that kind of go off the beaten path. Today, we're going to go deep below the earth to take a look at Digs by Catchy Software. Uh, this is an unusual take on tower defense. I think you're going to like it quite a bit. It's available on Windows and Mac. It says it doesn't run on newer Macs, but I am running it on a Mac M1 with the latest OS as of this recording, and it works fine. No issues whatsoever, so I don't know what's going on there. I mean, the, it doesn't even show up with a slash on the desktop, so no idea what's going on there. But uh, anyway, it does work fine. Uh, there's another weird thing about this. Right now it's listed as $49.99. There's an interesting story there. Oh, let's just go on, right? I originally, <laughs> let's just go on the tirade. I originally got this uh, for free from the developer. And uh, they had some kind of problem with their keys. And my key got revoked. <laughs> so, yeah, it got revoked. But I went and bought it again because uh, it was like right when it released. And it was a little bit less than $5. But anyway, right now, if you look, it's $49.99, which ain't right. Uh, because you can go ahead and get the bundle. And I highly recommend that you get the bundle. Uh, it is Diggs, Diggs Mini Icy. I'm looking through my mic. Wharf. And for all three of those games, you get $5.60 for that. Hi, all. Future Rob here. And I just wanted to note that this video is recorded over a month ago now and unfortunately the prices have changed uh the current price for the triple pack of digs is six dollars and seven cents so i'm very sorry if that puts you out anyway let's get to the description on this one digs take on the ultimate tower defense challenge in digs a roguelike game where you shape the battlefield mine resources and strategize against a variety of enemies Manage your actions, customize your arsenal with upgrade cards, and explore diverse levels. Can you dig in and emerge victorious? All right, folks, let's get going with some digs. Uh, you got the credit section. I think that's self-explanatory. You got upgrades. This is fun. <laughs> I like the way he said that. Like a, <laughs> like a middle-aged soccer mom. That's fun. We're going to sell cookies. All right, anyway. Anyway, this is a support section. Um, noise. This is, you'll figure this out in a minute, but this is uh, basically how long you have or how many moves you can make before the round starts. We've got crystals. This is different upgrades you can make to your crystals. And uh, let's see. So I can buy that. Get these little diamonds. Uh, for every round you beat. Orbs, same thing. Traps, same things. Magic. There we go. And uh, let's hit back. And you got a collection. This shows the things that you've unlocked and seen. See? Enemies haven't unlocked a whole lot. So there's more to go. And then, of course, you can exit. But why would you ever want to do that? By the way, look at this guy's hat. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty dorky orky. All right, we're going to go do this level because it's new to me. And uh, let's see. If we do normal, we get five. We, hard, you get 10. Uh, extreme, you get 15 of these diamonds that you use for the upgrades that I showed you earlier. We're going to just do normal because uh, otherwise I'm going to get my butt kicked. Um, I'm getting better, though. All right, so this is interesting. This is how this is... It sounds like I edited that. Anyway, yeah, I didn't. It's just how I talk, I guess. Anyway, all right. So this is a little bit different from other tower defense games in that I basically dig. And, uh, <laughs> which is the name of the game. And that uncovers the path I'm going to make. But it also uncovers stuff like this. There we go. So, uh. I got an extra card I can play. However, I need to have something on the field to do that, I'm afraid. I'm getting a lot of these. I will take... I'm going to take a frost trap. Select. 
I mean, it's otherwise pretty normal tower defense. Oh, I just made a mistake. I accidentally pressed stuff. I can zoom in and out. Not sure if this is just a Mac thing, but uh, when I zoom out, it like zooms all the way out the first time. Not sure if that's a bug that exists in the PC version. Uh, note that I am running this right now on an M1 Mac. Yeah, we're going to talk about that in a minute. Uh, so it will run on that. Oh, man. There has been... Boy, it is not giving me much in the way of towers yet. I'm going to do a frost trap. Come on. Come on, frost trap. Oh, stop it. Come on. Get in there. Oh, I got insufficient noise. I can't do it. I wanted to do a frost trap right there. Uh, just to make sure that they go. I'm going to put it over here. I'm going to move my gold over here. So this is where the orcs start. And then this is where they end up. So I want to put as much between me and them as possible. Hit it! Oh, I'm dead meat. Yeah, I... Boy! Yeah, that's some crap. <laughs> uh... So far, I've had, like, nothing. <laughs> I'm going to start... Can I do this? Oh, you jerk. Yeah, I can't upgrade that. See, I can upgrade this. I can upgrade a trap with a new trap, but I can't upgrade a tower without a tower. Here we go. Yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we are getting somewhere. We're going to switch over to a zapper here. Do I... Can I not upgrade that with a... Yeah. Crud. You can only upgrade uh, towers with certain cards. All right. Uh, this gives me another one of these. And you know how many uh, tower defense games, like, you, you just... Never want to lose any. Yeah, well, good luck. You're gonna lose some on this. It's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be hard on you. I'm just saying. All right, there we go. Now let's back this up. Now I'm gonna do a lot better this round. So that's a good thing. And now I'm gonna enforce this. Some other notes. See these little red guys right here? They're bad. Don't hit them. If you do, something bad's going to happen. We don't want bad things happening. All right, here we go. There we go. I'm in trouble, like, right out of the gate here. Upgraded to a zapper. Uh, let's keep going. So now I'm starting to get some actual, like, decent stuff, though. So notice how I can just pick them up and move them as I choose them. Which is... Pretty nice, I think. Got three. Might as well take this. Up my gold supply. Yeah, I could do that. So this is basically a repair. If I choose this, uh, instead of 26, I'll have more, more of these. It'll increase them. Got a luck increase here. I could get better cards. I'm going to take the smart crystal, though. And we're going to do some massive damage right from the get-go here. Oh, wait. Wait, yeah, no, this is a regular one, right? I didn't upgrade that. Okay, cool. Talking to myself. All right, let's hit the Eye of Sauron. Loving it. 
There we go. I, I love how a bad thing happens every round. <laughs> what jerks. So now we're going to put this guy right here. And... Ah, no, I'm going to have to take this. Oh, I got something good. What the? Ooh, that never happens. I always get crap when I choose those. All right. Now you can see what I'm doing is I'm basically forcing it to go around both sides. And we've only got a couple more left. And see, I'm going to be blocked out from doing that, but I'm not blocked out from doing this. Huh? 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 Yeah. All right. Let's get it on. That did not sound good. Oh, wait. I got one more left. So I can do that. All right. Let's do this. Looking good. There we go. Yeah, I hate those healers. Um, What can I do? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I got these. I'm going to do this. Huh? Huh? Yeah. That's good stuff. And might as well take that. Anything that makes our life more difficult, I'm going to do. I'm pretty good on gold supply, so I'm just going to do a frost trap. And if I put it right... Actually, gonna put this here and frost trap them right there. <gasps> move here. Let's move this over. All right, there we go. Suckers! I could put the zapper here since I got one more point. I think I'll do that. All right. Dang. Ah, oh, the joy of tower defense. I hate that guy. There you go. Did I get him? Yeah, he's coming around. Defeated. Oh, I hate those. Hate those. Uh, let's see. What are we going to do? This. Keep digging. Well, I should use that. I just drag it, I think. Yep, there we go. And I get an extra gem at the end of this round. Yay. And... <sighs> Move that. Keep them on the path. Oh, I got two left. So. This makes them go a little bit further. Hmm. I can do nothing with this, so I'll take this guy. I plan everything so that I can survive the round. 
uh, you can move things around. So, you know, utter forward thinking is not, I mean, you want to think forward, but like not so far that you cut yourself in the neck early on. And, uh, one thing that can happen is it can spawn a new spawn. So at any point it can spawn a new place for the monsters to come out of. And that's bad when that happens. So you could get really stuck. But right now I only have one spawn, so that's good. Let's zoom out a little bit. What else can I do? See, and there's a the thing. I can take a risk and then I can be hosed, which I just got hosed there. And, of course, right there. There we go. Hit the eye. Wave 7 of 10. One mild annoyance is I can't, uh, I can't move the map. I can zoom. Wait, can I do WASD? Yeah, I can. Okay. For whatever reason, it, does, it uh, disables mouse scroll. So I can do a WASD. That's fine, then. Okay, 11 rounds right now. Or 11 moves. Sorry. Oh, this is wonderful. Okay. Wow, you can't complain about that. That is a lot of... Uh, New damage I'm doing here. If I put that one there. I put this guy here. Can I put it there? No. I can put it here. Wait, here. I kind of like it. Can't put that there. Put it over there. And uh, here we go. Let's move this guy here. And I move one of these here. Mm -hmm. I can increase the uh, range of these, which I haven't done yet, and I should probably do. Okay, I got one move left. And I'm going to use that. Wave seven. Here she goes. All right, so I'm using WASD to move uh, in between rounds. I, I know I mentioned this, but I'm just elucidating. Um, in between rounds, I can use the mouse to do this, but for whatever reason. Yeah. Yeah. I like doing a lot of... Um, a lot of damage early on, if I can. And just drop that. And booyah! I got more than I started with. All right, final arrangements. And I'm way over here. So I'm pretty far from the spawn. I'm surprised it has not made a second spawn. So I'm 
pretty lucky right now. I don't like the healer digs at all. Okay, 11 moves. Ah! Where am I? I'm over here. Well, I can at least do... How can I do this? Well, I know how I can do it. I can do this, do this, then do this, then do this. Ha! You know, as in regular tower defense, you just want to make a maze, you know? All right, here we go, last wave. Am I going to survive it? Yeesh. Doing pretty good so far. I don't care for the healer. Causing me trouble. Ugh. How is this guy living? Why isn't anything attacking? Chesty makes spawn mores. A great name. He's almost dead. This will be the first time I killed one of them. Yeah, he's dead. Yes! And I will survive this round. Looks like looks like I'm gonna survive with the gold I came in with. There we go. Nice. Got it! Go back, go back, go back. There we go. And as you can see, I've got a little bit more money for upgrades now. So pretty nice. There we go with digs. And that wraps it up for digs. Available on Windows and Mac. Played here on the Mac Pro M1 Pro. Is that how you do that? I want... It's a Mac Pro M1. I'm pretty sure they're all Pro. That might not be true, but it doesn't matter. It works, and it works fine, uh, even though it's listed as not compatible for whatever reason. Uh, note that right now, it's listed as $49.99, which I believe is a typo. In fact, it's definitely a typo because I paid $4.99 for it. Uh, also, don't worry about that because you can get the Digs and Wharf bundle right now for $5.60, uh, or you can get the Digs bundle for $7.65, and it comes with Diggs Mini. So whatever's going on with that, they probably should get it fixed. But doesn't matter. It's a fun game. I enjoyed it. Uh, so good first impression. I'll probably continue to play it a little bit. I noticed there's an iPad version. I might actually put that onto there because I like playing Tower Defense before I go to bed. Anyway, I want to thank you very much for watching this. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in a couple days. Bye. Thank you